Well, isn't it a fine moment to have a cup of tea? <laughs> Hi, welcome. If you are new here, my name is Jan and I would love it if you subscribe if you want to hang out and have tea with a friend. I'm your friend. <laughs> We're going to check out some new tea, new to me, and uh, maybe see what you guys think of the packaging and the whole thing. Steep it up in a cup and we'll see how it tastes and maybe, I don't know, have a chat or something. If you've been around for a while, you know that I'm probably still just a little recovering from Vlogmas. It was so nice to have Jeanette, my wife, join me. That was like really special. And I know like a few years ago, if you look at old videos, you might have noticed that, you know, she never came on camera and like rarely would even talk off camera. So it was so much fun to have her join me. She is actually um, volunteering right now. So she does some volunteer work, as many of you guys know, and uh, she's off doing that. So I thought it would be a great time for you and I just to have a quiet cup of tea. Maybe we'll bring out an antique Ainsley and steep up tea and uh, yeah, have a good time. <laughs> Let me show you what I got. This was gifted to me with no strings attached, um, but I did want to show you guys because look at how beautiful that is. It is just, you guys know, I love a nice box, nice packaging. This purple is just, oh, it really is so nice. It's a nice feel to it as well. Now let's get to the tea. This is magnetic, by the way. Then it opens up and we have these three teas. Let's see, what do we have? Pumpkin chai, creamy Earl Grey, and untamed turmeric. So you know, you know what I wanna try. Creamy Earl Grey. So, so pretty. And this is the type of thing though, like this box you can reuse. You know it will be. So this company here, Le Bon Phil, Phil? Oh gracious. You know, <laughs> I can barely speak English, let alone uh, French, but I believe this means the good girl. Fine tea company. There we go. All right, so this here is the container. Um, this is like a hard cardboard uh, over and then this beautiful design. I love that. This here feels like cardboard as well. And then this feels like a light metal. Oh, and it's actually tea bags. I don't know why I was uh, assuming a loose leaf. I really don't explore things too much without you guys. <laughs> I like to kind of explore without too much knowledge so that we can kind of, you know, figure things out together. I will try to find out how much this would be and put that up on the screen as well. Mmm, smells wonderful. There we go. All right, let's see. What do they say? There are 12 biodegradable sachets in here and it says creamy Earl Grey, luscious, sweet black tea. The ingredients are, they're all organic, black tea, orange peel and corn flowers, and then there's natural essence. And it says may contain almonds, cashews, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds and walnuts. Caffeine is medium to strong. Steep one bag at 100 degrees Celsius for two minutes, two to five minutes with milk. I like that they say that, that's really nice. It is a uh, USDA organic certified and it's Canadian organic certified as well. And this company is from Toronto, Ontario. All right. Let's, uh, let's steep this up. Mm. Anybody looking for a Gare Bear fix? 
There is my baby snoozing away on the sofa. Hi, Carrie. Nope, sleeping. So handsome. All right, let's pick out a teacup. <laughs> oh, gracious. It never gets old. I love this so much. Oh, brings me so much joy. Which teacup do you guys want to use? Which one? Do, do, do. That one? Which one? This one? Okay. We can use this one. This here, um, they're all antique Ainsley's, of course, in my turquoise color. This one here has a lovely rose. I think this is a J. A. Bailey. Yep, signed down there. So pretty. So beautiful. Okay, let's uh, let's go make some tea. timer has gone off so I am going to pull this out of here let me see if I can show you guys the there we have that and now we have our tea I am I'm glad you guys picked this one very nice teacup I, um, I really like the big rose. I do love this shape. Uh, my, my favorite shape for the antique Ainsley's that I have is actually the corset shape. And that's where it's like higher at the top and then it narrows in at the bottom like a corset. It's like that. Um, I probably have one. I have one right there. Let me grab it. This here is actually broken. I, it's not in with my collection or anything like that. I did um, play around with that. What is that word? It's, I'll put it on the screen. It starts with a K. It's for um, using, oh, gracious. You guys know words are not my friend most of the time. Anyways, uh, I did design stickers um, and this was the teacup that the sticker was designed off of. Of course, I did add an extra crack into the sticker, but uh, otherwise it is very similar to this. Anyways, this is the corset shape that really scoop. I really like using these teacups for like if I'm having a pot of tea, but whereas this was just a tea bag, uh, you guys chose right in having more um, volume in there and having like that bowl like shape with this one so gorgeous really nice handle too okay mm. it is nice i feel like it could have um For my palette, what I'm going to do next time that I steep this, I'm going to use a lower temperature, um, slightly less time. I went just above the two minutes. I would probably do like 185 degrees instead of 200 and I would probably go like just, just at the two minute mark from when I started pouring for this amount or I'd use a little bit more water. but it is nice. I just think that I can just like push it a little bit farther. <laughs> and that is the wonderful thing about tea is that, you know, you can play around with it so many different ways and it's gonna taste different. And the other thing is too, is that everybody's taste buds are so different and your taste buds are changing, which is what I love. 
Well, mine are. Let me know how yours are doing. Mm. Yep. Mm. I am going to enjoy this tea. Maybe I'll have to save Jeanette a jam jar. <laughs> But I would love to hear from you guys and just catch up with you and see how you've been doing. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this short, quick tea session together. And I hope your day is spectacular. I hope you know how much I appreciate you. Thank you. Until next time, take care. Bye!